The views and opinions expressed on any program are those of the persons appearing on the program and do not necessarily reflect the views and opinions of the New Media Factory. Some programs on this network might include strong images and language and may not be suitable for all audiences. Viewer discretion is advised. And here are the pros. Richard Del Rosario. Jason Webb. Miko Halili. Welcome to the Bro Show. Hello, bros. Hi, bros. Welcome back to the Bro Show. Uh, if, if, and you, of course, you'll notice that uh, there, there we're only two. Yeah. Two out of uh, two out of three. Yes. Kasi po yung kasama namin si. Uh, <laughs> Jason, eh, meron pang Valentine hangover. Yun. In fact, sa sobrang lala, mukha oh. niyang Valentine hangover. Oh. Oh. Na-confine. Na-hospital. <laughs> Na-hospital. Kasi naman matagal na, pagbigyan mo naman kasi. Matagal, Bakit ba? Matagal na parang... Uh, na, di, di nasanay. Oo, oh, parang ngayon, pinagsabay-sabay. Oo. Oh. <laughs> Ayun, na-overdose. <laughs> na uh, na-overdose sa Valentine's. Yeah, yan. Kaya, anyway, kaya. so get well soon. Uh, uh, Jason is a bit under the weather, so... Uh, get well soon uh, to our bro. Yep. Uh, he'll be back next week. Don't worry. He'll be back uh, next week. In the meantime, I'm still here. My name is Miko Harili. Richard Del Rosario. And we're here to talk about this, this, the stuff that the bros are talking about. Yeah. Okay? Mm-hmm. And what the bros are talking about right now, mm-hmm. okay, today mm-hmm. is the big trade that happened this morning wow. in the PBA. Yeah, shocking, no? What a way to uh, start the week, no? Because it's Tuesday, na, pero... Ano pa rin? Uh, da- daming involved. Uh, four teams. Four teams. And then players ba yun? Seven ba yun? Or... Ay, may picks pa. No, may oh. picks pa eh. No? Kaya, uh, well, not surprising dahil nga in between uh, conferences, uh, teams that are on a break, uh, medyo nagre-retulul eh, trying to uh, find the right personnel. Para... Yabang o. Oh. Yabang ng dating mo bro ha. Para sinasabi mo, yung mga di na sa finals, bayaan mo yan. Kaya nag, 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 pa, nagkakandara pa sila making changes. Parang ganun yung dating eh. Hindi na naman kasi alam eh. Assistant coaches ang sekreto dyan eh. Ay, ganun ba? <laughs> ah, ganun ba? <laughs> Oo oh, yan. Siyempre eh. Kasi busy ako kaya hindi ko masyado na follow Busy ako sa finals, man. Bro, busy ako. <laughs> Grabe. Uy, good luck. Good luck sa Thank game 3. Oh, uh, coming up again. Uh, yes. coming up. Okay, so let's 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 just do a recap of the trade. And uh, bottom line, these are the players that moved. Uh, Sol Mercado <laughs> and Rico <laughs> Mayer over. Si Ang ganda ng picture ni Rico. Pero si Rico nagartista na. Oh. So po from basketball and oh. showbiz na lang Para siya. Ano, y- yan yung ano eh, ng uh, pinakamagandang picture niya sa internet uh. eh. <laughs> so Sol Mercado and uh, Rico Mayer over are now part of the San Miguel Beermen. Yes. Uh, Alex Cabagnot, who has been with Petron for the longest time, yes. will now move to uh, Global, Global Port, Port, along with Bonbon Bon Custodio. Yes. Uh, and then Jonas Villanueva, the fourth person in that graphic, will move to Air 21. And then you have Leo Nahorda and Jason Deutschman, who will now join Barajo. Barajo Bull. Mm-hmm. And then yeah, there are some picks in also involved oh, in I the trade. I think uh, 2016, huh? 2017 second round pick uh, will go also to Air 21. Yeah, but the four guys in the graphic, okay, uh, more or less, the, yan yung mga pinaka-importante. Pero yung pinaka-ano pa rin doon, yung pinaka-explosive pa rin doon is the, of course, the Sol Mercado and Alex Cabagnot trade. Which is, yun nga, y- yan yung trade talaga, na classic trade. Yes. My point guard for your point guard, yes. palit tayo. Yes, yun. Palit tayo. Oh, oh, and, and, uh, and, and it's juicy because, uh, you know, Alex is one of the best point guards in the PBA. Mm-hmm. Sol is one of the best point yes. guards in the PBA. In fact, Sol, you know, had a, had a great uh, Philippine oh, yes, Cup yes. for Global Port. So, hindi mo, hindi mo rin isipin na Global Port would give him up. That's correct. But uh, probably Alex Cabagnot coming into the picture on the table might be too good to pass up also when mm-hmm. you have to sacrifice... Kasi isipin mo rin, marami rin namang mga young point guards itong uh, Global Port. Plus the fact na bago yung coach nila, Pido. Diba? Okay. So, uh, and he has worked with Alex when, because Nung he came na, nasa, from... Sa, uh, nasa Petron, nasa Petron dati, siya. Yeah. So, probably yun nga, yung familiarity, mas gusto niya. Kasi I don't think he has worked with Sol before. So, gusto niya siguro, familiar na kagad siya doon sa point guard. Actually, ang hinihingi talaga ni Coach Pido sa hmm. Petron, oh. si Jojo Dunsil. 
Jojo dun si... Ayaw ibigay ng petrol. Aba? Si Alex na lang. Untouchable. <laughs> si Kabandot na lang. Si Kabandot na lang. Oo, oh, yun lang. Eh, siyempre gusto repeat to, mga growling tigers eh. Yeah, oo. Oh. Oh. Pero, I mean, kasi we have to mention also na nagkaroon din ng changes sa uh, coaching staff ng uh, Petron, which is going to be San Miguel. Yeah, okay. and that actually happened before itong yes. mga trades na ito nangyari. Uh, so now, uh, you have uh, Biboy Ravanes yes. as the head coach. head coach. And then you have uh, Todd Purves as the taking a more active role. Active consultant. As an active. Mm-hmm. What is an inactive consultant? Yung nakupo ka lang. <laughs> <laughs> so ito, active. Oh. Active oh. consultant. Oh. Oh. Yeah. So in other words, ito yung consultant na nag, nag, the jumping jump. <laughs> Kasi hindi inactive consultant eh. Mahirap na pang oh. nakasuit ka. Nakikita uh, mo si <laughs> Coach Todd, eh, nakasuit <laughs> lagi yan, di ba? Hirap na mag-jumping jack ha. Oh, mga ganyan, ganyan. So, stretching na active consultant and then si G will now be the team manager. And then, unfortunately, si Coach Leo Austria will no longer be with the team. That's correct. That's what we've read and what we've heard. So, yun. Grabe, no? Ibig sabihin nito, yung San Miguel, o Petron, and now they'll be the San Miguel Beermen, I mean, really exhausting every possible move to have a better performance in the next conference. Especially now that babalik nga sila into being uh, San Miguel. Oh. Na? So, uh, siguro, gusto nila talaga ang ano, uh, maganda yung pagbalik ng San Miguel sa PBA. It really changes everything because, oh, yes. I mean, now you're looking at starting unit mo, you have the import, mm-hmm. unlimited height, diba? Yeah. So, you have the import, then yeah, you'll have Arwin. No, and, not unlimited height, 6'9". Ah, 6'9", okay. Yeah. So, you have a 6'9 import, then you'll have Arwin, maybe like a Lasseter. Yeah. Uh, and then... Uh, well, si Sol. Sol. Yeah, will be, will oh. be there. I don't know. Si, oh, kunyari, uh, to, pwede kang mag-lats. Okay, oh, pwede kang mag-tubig. Fajardo. Oh, or Junmark pala. Sorry, oh, Junmark pala. Fajardo. Oh, so, yeah, Basta si Fajardo, yung import. Oh, yun nga, mag-Arwin ka. Tapos mag ka. Tapos, tapos si Sol. Sol. Oh. Tapos bago pa coach mo. Bago pa coach oh. mo. Tapos active pa yung consultant. Ayan. Oh. <laughs> I mean, really, I mean, it's, just, it's, it's really a new chapter. Oh, yes. Sa San Miguel. Yes. I mean, uh, a lot of new things will happen. Uh-huh. You don't expect. Kung may nakita niyo in the last tournament, I don't think you'll be seeing that in this tournament. Yeah, definitely and, because uh, uh, ano, sistema ni Coach Biboy na at uh, ni uh, Coach Tad. Uh, they will be. Because dun sa mga articles na nabasa ko, they'll be working closely together. Dapat mag Amerikana din si Coach Biboy. Dapat pwede, no? Dapat. Oh, oh nga, eh, no? Uh, tingnan natin, mali mo. I will talk to Coach Biboy. You talk to Coach naman si Coach Biboy. Oh, nga, eh. Bingo, Coach. Oh. Bakit mo naman ako ipagsusot? That's <laughs> Coach Biboy, diba? Sponsoran mo siya. Oh, diba? Uh, and then, of course, for Kabagnot, uh, a new chapter in his career also. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you know, so, sobrang nasanay na tayo na si Alex is in a Petron uniform. Yes. And now, he'll be playing for a new team. Yeah. Uh, magpahaba kaya ulit siya ng buhok. <laughs> Dito sa, <laughs> sa Global Port. Yeah, di natin alam eh, no? Pero, yeah, yeah. Curious to see also dahil Um, how in personality ni Coach Pido nakikita natin sa UAAP eh mga yan rin gusto makita eh kung yung pagiging fiery nitong si Coach Pido sa UAAP eh madadala niya dito sa uh, PBA bakit hindi? oo oh, 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 nga, nga. Kaya nga tapos except sa bagay most of yung sa global port naman mga young guns diba? ah. so talagang pwede niya talagang disiplinahin yung mga yan ay gusto ko yan oh. yung makita ko Pido you know kanya Pido with oh. Kabagnon oh. Pido with Jaywash yes. at lalong lalo na Coach Pido and Kelly Nabong yun hindi ko explosive <laughs> oh nga no oh, diba? maganda yan actually ha? even yung kanyari even yung Coach Pido with Terence Romeo yes uh, that, that's going to be very interesting yes. kasi si Coach Pido he's a no nonsense coach oh, oh. he'll tell you anong nilalaman ng isipan niya yes. he's not going to try and be sort of like politically correct. I mean, That's he's going correct. to be very honest with you. And then, you know, at least maririnig rin natin sa huddle niyo yung mga pick, pack, boom. <laughs> diba? <laughs> diba? Oh. J-Watch. Oh. Pick, pack, pick, boom. Pack, boom. And then si yeah. J-Watch. Uh, what's that, coach? <laughs> <laughs> Puta ka dito, boom. Oh. Yeah, oh, diba? Diba? Ganun, diba? Yeah. So, yan, okay yan. At, at, at least very colorful to personality <laughs> ni, ni uh, Coach Pido. And uh, tingnan rin natin, si Coach B-Boy. Diba? Tsaka si uh, Coach Todd. That's a, okay, so uh, I, I'm, it's fair for me to say that will be a sort of partnership 
Yes. Or basta it's a, it's a working relationship yes, kasi yes. Uh, Coach B-Boy has the title of head coach mm-hmm. and, and Todd Purves uh, yeah. from what I understand. Yun nga, I mean he he will have a really big role in terms mm-hmm. of uh, you know developing strategy, yes. game plans and mm-hmm. whatnot. Yeah. So, so yun, well, let's uh, wish uh, both teams uh, well but not well enough dahil <laughs> siyempre. <laughs> baka eh, alam mo naman biased ako eh. Uh, oh, di ba? Eh siyempre, di ba? Eh, sana ka kami pa rin, tuloy-tuloy. <laughs> okay. Uh, in line with what we uh, told you, uh, you know, marami na may alam ng balita about the trade, we'll talk with uh, Sol Mercado, uh, who'll now be a San Miguel beer man, as well as Rico Meyerhofer, who'll mm-hmm. all join Sol. Yes. Uh, in, in San Miguel, we'll talk to those two gentlemen live here in the Bro Show when we return. Hi. They say nothing in this world is free. And for the most part, that's true. But here at NMF Network, all shows are indeed 100% free. And as an added feature, you have the option to subscribe to all your favorite programs, also at no charge. Why should you subscribe? By subscribing, you no longer have the hassle of delays when you stream the program. You also don't need to keep checking our site to see if your favorite programs are up because they'll automatically be uploaded to your device as soon as it's available. Here's how to do it. First, open iTunes. Your next step, hit the iTunes Store button. A search bar should open up as soon as you do that. Type New Media Factory in the search bar and all your shows should open. Pick the show you like or all the shows you like. And once that opens, hit the subscribe button. And that's it, you're in. All shows will now be automatically downloaded to your device. Why did you refuse to be the Ascals head coach countless times? <laughs> I've been there, done that. Too much politics, like I said. Uh, like I posted one time a few days ago, coaching is a thankless job. With what's happening with Michael Weiss, uh, we talked about it already before, uh, personally, one-on-one, and I said, it happens. And I said, you should know that because you worked also somewhere in other countries as well. Uh, there's no such thing as a permanent job in coaching, in any sport. And now back to the bro show. Okay, a busy Tuesday for, mm-hmm. uh, for, for basketball fans because of all the wheeling and dealing among the PBA teams. And then one big name mm. is moving again. Yes. Okay, that big name is Sol Mercado and he'll play for, uh, you know, another team. Yes. In the PBA. Uh-huh. Pero yung bagong team niya, no less than the San, San Miguel, Miguel Beer Men. Beer Men. Okay, so to, uh, here to share his thoughts about, his, you know, a big change in his career. Uh, we have live on the line here in the Bro Show, Sol Mercado. Hi, Sol. Hey, how's it going, guys? Oh, hi, for, uh, hey, hey, hey Saul. Wow, wow. <laughs> hey, nice voice, man. This is Richard, Coach Richard Saul. <laughs> What's up, Coach? <laughs> How are you, Saul? How are you? I'm doing all right. So, Saul, uh, all right, give, give us your thoughts about this uh, trade that just happened. Uh-huh. Um, I'm actually, you know, really, really excited about it. Uh-huh. Um, you know, I I actually, you know, been praying about it, man. I've I since I've been in the league, uh, I've been on all, you know, startup teams. You know, just uh first year in the league, Rainershine was their it was their second year in the league and then and then uh, Morocco and Global Park first years in the league. So, you know, I never really been on a team that I can just come in and contribute, you know, to a, a, a winning team and, you know, a team that really has a legitimate chance to win a championship, you know, and where I don't feel like I have to do, you know, everything or, you know, everything doesn't weigh on my shoulders. You know, I have, uh, you know, there's a lot of uh, help. You know, if you look at, you know, all the top teams, there's, you know, they're pretty uh, well balanced yeah. you know, and, and, and have a lot of help. So, you know, I'm, I'm really excited for this opportunity. Now, how surprised were you, Saul, that, uh, that you actually uh, are involved in a trade, considering that you... You know, you, you, your your numbers were 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 great uh, for Global Port uh, during the Philippine Cup, and one would think that Global Port would never let you go. Um, how 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 uh, surprised are you that that you that you were traded to the San Miguel Beer Men? Well, to be honest with you, um, 
nothing really surprises me anymore. You know, I got <laughs> traded after I led the league in scoring and assists. So, mm-hmm. you know, after after that, you know, uh, it, it, it we didn't really. When I first started hearing my name was a trade talk, it did kind of surprise me because you know. Um, Boss Mikey, you know, he's the one that really brought me to this country and, and I'm really cool with Boss Eric. You know, and we and, and we talk on a, you know, pretty regular basis and, and I thought that they would really tell me if I was on the trading block. But um um you know, it all comes down to winning, you know, and and, and we didn't win as, as you know, Boss Mikey wanted to win a championship this conference and, and we didn't do that. And, you know, I, I'm sure that Patron wanted to win a championship this conference, and they didn't do that. So, you know, they're, I guess in this league, you know, they, they want to make changes right away, um, which isn't always the answer, but, you know, everything happens for a reason, and, and I don't really question what happens. I know it's a business, and, and uh, I know that God has, has plans for me wherever I go. Yeah, uh, so as you mentioned, you're, I mean, you've been in this situation before, but are you hoping that this is uh, going to be the final stop for the Soul Train? Yeah, yeah man. I, I mean, um, you know, everyone talks about, you know, I always hear talks, oh, Saul is traded again. I mean, I think I saw somebody tweeted, like, you know, Saul could could arguably go down as uh, the most talented traded player in PBA history. Someone said that, and I was like, wow, you know, it, it's, it's kind of a, you know, some people look at it as bad, you know, to be traded, you know, it, but when I was with Rainer Shine, I actually requested to be traded. You know, I was really young. I, I don't know if you were there, coach. Yeah, were uh, there? well, no, I wasn't there anymore. Because I okay, wouldn't yeah, trade you, Saul. <laughs> what, <laughs> what's that? I said, I, if I were there, I would not trade you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thanks. That means, that means a lot. But, um. You know, actually, when I was at Rainer Shine, I was really young and, and thought, you know, I, I didn't really know much, you know, and, and I made a huge mistake. You know, I was with my best friend on Rainer Shine, and, and I still look back to that day, and I wish I, I never requested to be traded, you know, and, and, and that was my my big, huge fault, you know, and, and, and I got a bad rep for that, you know, and that rep, you know, came on with, you know, I didn't get along with the coaches, and I was hard to coach, and then I, I got traded to Morocco, and um, to be honest with you, I don't know why I got traded from Morocco still to this day. You know, I, I really don't know. Um, Coach Ryan told me a reason that didn't turn out to be the reason. Mm-hmm. So, you know, it, it, it happens. And I kind of looked at it as, oh, well, this is a business. And I, and I kind of grew up from that and, and took it as something to make me stronger. You know, but this situation with Global Port, I really feel like, all my, you know, hard work and everything that I put in, you know, the six years in the league or whatever, I feel like, you know, I finally have this opportunity that I've been praying for, that I've been wanting, you know, and, and you know, I'm going to work so hard and, and do whatever I can to help, you know, uh, Patron or San Miguel get back to wherever, you know, that that the tradition is, used to be, you know, and, and whatever they ask me to do, whatever my role is, you know, even if it's, playing five minutes and being the biggest cheerleader, I don't mind doing that. You know, I'm not how I used to be when I was young, and I felt like I needed to do this, do that. You know, I understand that there's so much more to the game, you know, uh, of basketball than, than it was before. You know, Saul, I have a suggestion. If mm. you say, you know, you don't want to move to another team, you'd really want to spend like the next, what, five, six years with San Miguel? I have a suggestion, Saul. What's that? Uh, don't play well, <laughs> because it seems that every time you play well, you you know every time you average, you know double digit points and double digit assists, and you, or you lead the league in assists, you get traded. <laughs> yeah, I, I really don't understand, and 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 you know, and that's and that's the thing because people look at that and they say, oh, there's some, there has to be something wrong with Saul, you know, there's some he's uncoachable or or you know, and that's the rest that I built from the very first time, you know, my very first team, but I let go of all that. You know, I've grown up from that. I'm not that same person. So, you know, in this basketball world, it's so small, you know, so that it, it carries on with you, you know, and, and, and I, I, I guess I deserve it, but you know, um, it, it is pretty funny. You know, I still give my all every single game and, you know, I continue to be traded, but hopefully, you know, this is the last stop for me, man. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. Well, good luck, Saul. And, uh, uh, I do hope that you really find a home now in uh, in uh, San Miguel, and we wish you all the best. 
Yeah, I appreciate it, Coach. Appreciate that. Yeah, you look. Look, the San Miguel Beer Men, they're making moves mm -hmm. in order to win. Yeah. So they, they're not going to right. in, get Sol Mercado yeah. if, if they don't want to win. They, they right. got Sol Mercado because they want to win. That's right. And yeah. they got one of the best point guards in the PBA, one of the most passionate guys that, that we know. Although when you talk to him, it's, he's so chillax. <laughs> he's like, <laughs> he's, really, he's really chill. <laughs> and I, you know, I'm always surprised whenever we talk to Sol. Yeah. When, his, his image uh, to fans is that he, you know, he's this fiery you know, temperamental yeah, guy. But yeah. then when you talk to him, it's like he's sipping, you know, piña colada on the beach. <laughs> it's, yeah, it's just so chill. Uh, but so we look forward to you in a San Miguel uniform. I know you, you're, you're fully aware of the, you know, the history of the team and the pressures that go with it. And we wish you all the best. Yeah, man, I appreciate that, guys. Uh, to, to the fullest, I really, really appreciate it. Hopefully, you know, we could, pull this thing together and, and, and give the fans a championship, you know, that they've been waiting for. All right. Thanks, all. all right, thanks, all. Thank you very much. All right. Thanks, all right. That was Sol Mercado uh, live here on uh, The Bro Show. And, you know, that's what I like when we talk to guys here yeah. at The Bro Show. Uh, they're, they're very honest. Yes. You know, and, and Sol was very honest in saying that, it's also hard It's hard for a player that you keep on getting uh, traded because some para na papa isip ka what yes, is wrong with yes. me even if you're in demand yes diba? alam mo I've worked with Sol uh, when I was with Rainer Shine and yun is na sabi niya it was his first year or first two years here in the PBA and uh, sinas sabi niya at, at that time kasi it was very impulsive uh, madali sa mga ines bata pa daw siya eh. and but one thing good about Sol is that he really speaks his mind um, and and yun dun siya na mis uh, interpret uh, because of his a desire really to to win you know sometimes uh, probably his uh, manner of communicating that desire yun ang uh, nami misinterpret uh, but now seeing him uh, play dito sa global uh, I, I i saw maturity kay kay sol no even when trying to guide yung mga younger uh, players nila. Pag kinikriticize si Terence na masyadong ano, tira ng tira. Oh, siya pa nagtatanggol. Siya pa nagtatanggol uh. because uh, he knows that, you know, talented yung bata. Yeah. And, and uh, right now, I mean, given the right uh, uh, situation and culture siguro, I mean, this might be uh, the team for uh, Sol Mercado. And also, and now, you know, to also clarify, uh, we have live on the line all the former coaches of Sol. Huh? Oh, Nandiyan ba? Tatanong natin. Hindi, biro lang. Biro lang, biro lang. Biro lang. So, ano, uh, tapos na si Sol. Uh, ito, subukan natin tawagan naman. Si... In fact, uh, yung si, di ba, kinawas natin si Sol. Yeah. Eh, medyo nosebleed tayo, yes. di ba? That warm up pa lang yan. Yes. Kasi itong susunod na kakausapin namin, mm. mas nosebleed kami yes. dito. Kasi tinanong ko siya kung, uh, are you busy? Sabi niya, I'm good, coach. <laughs> you know, reply. Eh. Oh, this is it. Another guy involved in the mega trade that yeah. happened uh, today. Uh, so, uh, uh, Richard is now getting in touch uh, with him. But, you know, uh, uh, again, uh, big news of the day. Uh, you know, guys moving to different teams. Uh, we just spoke with Sol Mercado, who's now going to be a San Miguel beer man. And I'm sure with Sol, he realizes you know, that the, the pressure and the expectations that go along uh, with being a uh, point guard for uh, San Miguel. And, ang mas mabigat pa dun, he's replacing Alex Cabagnot. And Alex, it, and, 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 for, and for many fans, and Alex is, is like the permanent starting point guard for, for that team. Ano nangyari dun sa ano natin? <laughs> <laughs> Out of the coverage. Natakot <laughs> <laughs> ata eh. Natakot yata. Hindi mo muna siya yan, di ba? Ah, oh, oh, okay, oh, so anyway, uh, just to... Ito na, ito. Ayan na, ayan na. Ayan, nag-ring na. Nag-ring na. So, tingnan natin ha. Kung, hello, ano, are you ready? Uh, oh, you're ready. Okay, ah, wait okay, lang. Okay, here we go, here we go, ha? You're more than ready, ha? Oh. <laughs> okay, wait lang, wait lang. I'll put you on air, ha? Wait. So, okay, so again, ha? Uh, just so you know, Yung interview namin kay Sol, I mean, that was all English, right? Oh, of and course. That was our, that's warm up namin yun for this next interview. Oh, yes. Because, you know, you know we're not used to interviewing in English. So this I know. One, I mean, we, we have to really uh, be straight with our English with this guy. With this guy, with yeah. this guy, okay? Because yeah. he might not understand us that's if we correct. don't speak in English, no. okay? Hello? Right. <laughs> Hello? Hello? Hey, what's up, man? 
I'm good, man. How about you, guys? <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Rico Meyerhofer on the Bro Show. Lord, <laughs> Tagalog ako. <laughs> Natakot ka naman kaagad din. Nag-WhatsApp lang ako eh. Ano ka ba? Oh, Rico, kamusta? Okay naman, Coach. Oh, ano? Uh, anong uh, anong uh, tingin mo dito at uh, napunta ka na sa San Miguel? Ano ba ang pakiramdam mo? Siyempre, Coach, may halong lungkot kasi siyempre, galing din ako dun. Pag lahat naman ng players, diba, pag natitry, nalulungkot, diba? Hmm. Kasi may mga former teammates ka na may iwan, tapos yung hap, mga moments nyo, diba? So, Bakit, ano ba yung mga me, moments me, na yun? <laughs> Sino pinakamamimiss mo dyan? Sino pinakamamimiss mo? Sa Barako. Sa Barako. Uh, so, Pamimiss ko sa Barako, lahat halos eh. Sila Pinisi, si Miller, si Jesse, Oh. Si Ben, no? what's the name? Ah. Willie Wilson. Siyempre. Pero balita ko si Laro, nagsiselebrate eh. Ba't nalulungkot ka? <laughs> galing, galing ako kanina doon. Nandun ako nung nalaman na nung sa tuloy yung trade. So, oh, yun, anong reaction nila? Sila, parang parang nag-piesta yata sila. Siyempre, <laughs> 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 ano, may mga moments kami kanina na malulungkot lahat. Mm. Understandable naman kasi. Alam naman nila, lovable ko eh. No, no, eh, no. Alam mo, alam mo, Rico, naramdaman ko rin yan eh, di ba, nung sa dati, magkasama tayo, tapos bigla ka na trade. Hanggang ngayon, di pa ako nakaka-recover eh. Thank you, Bianco. Alam ko namang mahal mo rin ako. <laughs> Rico, uh, so mapupunta ka ng uh, San Miguel. Eh, siyempre, sa San Miguel, ibang expectations doon, kumpira sa, kunyari, sa Barako Bowl. Siyempre, sa San Miguel... Eh. Grabe yung pressure eh, to win, di ba? Alam naman natin lahat na ano eh, na hmm. I'll, I will do my best. Alam ko rin naman sa sarili ko na gawin ko lahat ng makakaya ko sa new team ko. And um, ang goal ko lang naman to be a best role player. Yan. O oh, ano naman so, na ano? Role pagka, player, oh. um, defense, rebound, yan. yung mga may contribute rin. Ano yung, naman, yung point sa akin, bonus na lang yun. Uh, Rico, Rico, ano naman ang, uh, siyempre, mga kasama mo dyan, si Sol, si Marcio, uh-huh. si uh, Lutz. Chris Lutz, no? Uh-huh. Tapos yung import. So, pag kasabay mo sila sa court, ano naman masasabi mo sa kanila? Uh, masasabi ko sa kanila? Oo. Siyempre, siyempre um, sila ngayon yung family ko and what uh-huh. do Paano, kunyari ako, kunyari ako si Sol, what will you tell me, bro? Um, sabi ko, so, I got your back, man. Hindi na mo kaya okay si Rico. Uh, Kahit sino uh, kayang pakisamahan eh. Yan ang maganda kay Rico eh. Tama. Oh. Oh. Pero Rico, balita ko, kaya kakinuha ng San Miguel, ikaw daw babate kay Jun Mara sa insayo araw-araw. <laughs> okay lang ba sa'yo yun? Uh, medyo masakit dyan ah. Hindi <laughs> 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 ba, Ali, meron ka naman, nung, ano ba yun, yung recovery? Oh, ano ba yun? Oh. Ano ba yung Rico yung negosyo mo negosyo yung mo, plug parang mo na. yung nila nakikita sa Instagram ng mga ah, fans yan eh. Ano ba yan? Kasi tinutulungan ko yung friend ko mayari ng ano recovery tech. Oh, ano ba yung recovery tech? Hey, follow, na yan? follow niyo sa Instagram. Hmm. Ano siya? Galing siya sa US. So, oh. pinup- pinapasok namin sa Philippines kasi iba na yung player na may ano eh, may advantage. So, makukuha mo talaga yung advantage ng decks mo pag ginamit mo yung Thermatech recovery therapy. Ano ba ginagawa noon? Ano bang nagagawa noon pag na- sinuot mo yun sa legs well, mo? Eh, kasi si Lebron James ginagamit yun. Uh-huh. So, yun, yun na yung main endorser namin si Lebron James. Lebron James, Tapos, ha? Oo, oh, Lebron James, Armelo, Anthony. Marami What? na halos lahat sa NBA. Nakuha mo yun as endorser? Kinausap mo sila? <laughs> ben, Ben. Nakita <laughs> <laughs> ko lang siya. Ayaw ni, um, alam siya? mo, Rico, oh, ayaw ano ni siya? Coach Richard nung ganyan eh. Yung ano parang siya? machine. Ang gusto ni Coach Richard, manual. <laughs> sa hita. <laughs> manual na masahe. <laughs> Pero meron din nun. Pero mas, mas ano to eh, mas effective to eh. Ah, mas effective. <laughs> ah, mas effective oh. yan ah. Well, uh, Rico, so, ano? Ano, ano? ano no? Yan na siya. Uh, follow natin sa Instagram. Okay, yeah, yeah, sige. Instagram. Gagawin natin yan. Sige, oh. sige. Uh, meron bang extra small size yan para kay Miko? <laughs> pwede, pwede. Lahat yan. <laughs> yung ano, para may adjust nyo lang eh. Kasi pag si Miko gagamit yan, dapat half price lang. <laughs> 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 yung akin, nagandib-dib eh. <laughs> o, o Rico, ano na lang, uh, word, uh, message para sa mga San Miguel fans na yun, excited na rin siguro makita ka no, in a San Miguel uniform. Um, sa message sa San Miguel beer fan, um, thank you sa warm welcome kasi nababata ko yung mga tweet nila mm-hmm. since kayo ng umaga. 
And I will do all my best. Lahat ng power ko para ma maprove ko yung worth ko as a San Miguel player. Yun. Ah, okay. So, good luck, ha? Good luck sa San Miguel Beer Men uh, in the coming conference. Thank you. Thank you, Coach. Okay. Thank you, Sir Miko. Salamat, Rico. Thank you. Thanks, Salamat. Rico. Good luck. Thank you. Okay. So, ayan, ha? No. Nakakausap natin. Two, two of the newest. Yes. Two of the newest San Miguel Beer Men. Uh -huh. Sol Mercado and Rico Meyerhofer. Wow. Okay. So, between the two, Naturally, Sol will play a bigger role Kasi parang na-imagine mo na Starting point guard si Sol Wala naman siyang kalaba Although sila ni Ross They'll be reunited Sort of And then Tsaka said they're very good friends Si Rico Ano magiging papel ni Rico? Sa nakikita mo ha What will be his role? Somebody who can give Somebody can back up Arwin Santos Okay So kasi I think It's one of their problems Sino papalit mo kay Arwin? Ah Uh, pag, sa line up nila. Uh, every, every time he'll sit every down, he'll sit down. So, si Rico can give them that. Uh, yung minutes, uh, quality minutes off the bench, uh, and he can play the same role as uh, kay Arwin. Although, syempre, yung throughout his career naman, ang role naman talaga ni Rico is really to get rebounds, be a pesky defender. So, yun. Uh, I think, ano, lalalim talagang uh, bench ng uh, San Miguel or uh, Petron. Oh, sige, while we're on the topic, matanong mm. na rin kita. Mm. If you were to compare, uh, and I'm not going to ask you to like name sino yung better player, but mm -hmm. just compare, uh, let's say, uh, the difference, what is the difference between Alex Cabagnot and Sol Mercado? I think Sol is a better one-on-one -on -one player that can break down the defense on his own. He can create yung kunyari, uh, kasi he's, he's used to the dribble drive offense. And, and si Sol can create off, the, off of that. Si Alex naman is one of the smartest pick and roll players or guards that we have in the league right now. He knows how to read kung anong depends ang ginagawa ng kalaban. You know, he doesn't force his shots. But at the same time, uh, he's willing to take it in the end game. Uh, so, yun naman ang strength rin nitong si uh, Alex Cabagnot. But, but definitely, two of the top guards in the league today. Okay, so uh, we'd like to thank again Sol Mercado and Rico Meyerhofer for uh, calling up and uh, talking to us here in the Bro Show. And I will take a short break. And when we return, we'll talk about the ongoing mm -hmm. Philippine Cup Finals oh. Huh? Oh. between the Rainer oh. Shine Alaska Painters and Coach Chards San Mig Coffee. Uh, San Mig Super Coffee yeah. Mixers. All that when we return. Hi guys, it's me, Tita K. Tita K. Come and hang out on Live Love Lols. Let's talk about makeup, beauty. Hi, Ganda. Who's that? We can talk about ugly too. Nah, no, just kidding. And of course, Donya problems galore. Yeah, yeah. I'm special. Pake on. Fashion, shopping. Oh my god, shopping. I love shopping. Ah! Food. We gotta talk about food. Anything and everything on cyberspace. Let's buy everything. We can talk about glamour and ubusan ng glamour. We fly Wednesday 6 to 7 p.m. only on nmfnetwork.tv. Tell me, what is football for you? Wow, football, that's my life, you That's my life. That's my life revolves around sport. That's it, I mean, everything is there. It's not football, it's nothing else. And now back to the Bro Show. Uh, welcome back to the Bro Show. And uh, well, as always, we love it when we go basketball over, uh, overload. Yes. Uh, so we, we talked about a mega trade uh, involving uh, like 100 teams and 200 players. <laughs> uh, we talked with Sol Mercado and Rico Meyerhofer earlier. And now we'll talk about the ongoing finals, that, which yeah. involves, of course, Rainer Shine and my uh, partner's uh, team. Sammy Coffee. So mm -hmm. we've uh, we've gone through two games now. Mm -hmm. uh, can you give me like a non-biased account <laughs> <laughs> of the two games so far? Kaya nila ko yan. May lumapit sa yon, bro. Hindi ko na pa yung first two games. Eh. Ano ba nangyari? Ang galing ng Sammy Coffee. Pero yeah. <laughs> <laughs> unbiased. Eh, unbiased. And then not dikit, no. Oh. I mean, uh, very you know, uh, very uh, tightly fought uh, games. Uh, ang ganda ng game one. Para sa rain or shine. <laughs> Kasi <laughs> we, we, game we felt we had a good chance already. Uh, Kasi si Pauli, maganda yung play talaga uh, nila. And then, and, uh, you know man, we were able to recover from that. And uh, 
uh, were able to uh, bounce back in, in game 2. The same time, medyo marami ring mintis yung Rainer Shine sa from the field, yung shooting nila, hindi ganun ka on target sa game 2. Uh, okay, I, you know, the thing about the series, and everyone, any, anytime someone asks me, di ba pag series kasi, da, kadalasan meron kang favored, meron yeah. kang underdog. Yeah. In this series, wala akong mapili eh. Parang match lang eh. I, I cannot say one team is, ah, ito, favored to. Ah, ito, ito, underdog. Wala akong, hindi no, ko masabi. He, because of probably yung um, reputation namin when it comes to, nandun laki kami sa playoffs, di ba? Oh, okay. But if you look at yung just a head-to-head matchup between these two teams, mm-hmm. nee, I mean, nag-end ang Rainer Shine, what? Number two. Oh. Kami, number five. Yeah, but that's only because he had a slow start. Yes, but in the four games na nag-harap kami, oh. isang beses pa lang namin sila tinatalo. Mm-hmm. Kami into the series, tinalo nila kami twice in the end. Tambak pa ng isang buwan yung isa. Mga bro, ha? ito, okay. it's the oldest trick in the book. <laughs> Kahit anong level ng, ng basketball, uh, high school, college, <laughs> PBA, NBA, lahat ng coach, when you ask them, hmm. automatic, magpapadehado yan. Alam mo kung bakit? Bakit? Para pag manalo ka, magaling ka. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> diba? <laughs> Nag- tsaka ang hirap din eh. Separate, I, I think in our, in our culture also, oh. I, you don't wanna sound too uh, overconfident. Yes. Parang iyabang mo para sabihin na, oh, oh, we're with the favorite team. Mag- magyabang ka, tapos natalo ka, di tanga ka. Oh, kaya, <laughs> that's why, that's why. But, but <laughs> ano naman, diba? Tama naman na, uh, you know, people can look at this series and, and think that, Match na match siya. Match talaga. Oh. I mean, especially, I mean, you cannot, Rain or Shine is, is a team that utilizes its bench uh, more than any other team in the league. And, and uh, uh, talaga yung efficiency of their players, grabe. Ah, kung meron tayo efficiency rating, uh, nobody in that team averages more than 30 minutes a game on the whole, in the whole uh, conference. So, anytime, I mean, yun ang natutunan namin. We've played Rain or Shine in a number, in a series Last year, uh, with, with Blakely and Cornley, tapos uh, again in the Philippine Cup last year, semis. And bigla na lang may isang player na you don't expect na puputok, na bigla puputok. So, I mean, uh, it's a very deep team. That's why sinasabi ni Coach Heng, as the longer the series goes, eh, paburaw sa kanila. Kasi, yun nga, alam niya, meron siyang depth. Oh, kasi parang uh, mas, pag- mas magiging pagod ng kalaban. Kasi nga, yung minutes ng uh, Rainer Shine, bawal lumagpas ng 20. Eh. Yeah, oh. Di ba? Unless, unless ka 40 points ka. Not, but, uh, oh, not only that. Plus, uh, tinalo nila yung global. Uh, one game, one game, lang, game uh, lang. Tapos tinalo nila yung... Uh, Petron. Yung Petron five in, games. in five games. Oh. So, eh kami, na-stretch kami ng token text. Tapos, stretch rin kami ng, ano, ng uh, Barangay Hinebra. So, talagang isipin mo talaga. Kung humaba ito, papabor sa kanila. And I know we, we always mention this about, you know, when you scout Rain or Shine, and they're sort of like impossible to scout. Mm. Because si coaching, may mga ibababad siya na player na actually, hindi maganda nilalaro the yeah. last time. or yeah. So, di mo isipin, ah, hindi niya ibababad like, yan. For example, take game one for example. Biglang nag-start si Jeric Teng. Oh, exactly. Diba? Exactly, oh. I mean, hindi nga siya masyado nagamit nung elim- whole elimination, even during playoffs against Petron. All of a sudden, nag-start sa finals. Right. <laughs> diba? Oh. So, yun yung mga panggulat rin ni Coach Sheng talaga. And, you know, he, he made, gave a good account of himself, uh, talking about Jeric, in the first few minutes of that uh, game. He also gave a good account of himself kay Malyari. Kasi, medyo nagtirahan sila eh. Oh, yeah. Ay, ta- alam mo, tapang din ni Jeric. Ah. Oh. I mean, for a rookie, he's not exactly like putting up spectacular numbers. Ah. <laughs> Pero iba rin yung confidence ng bata. Ah. Ay, eh, sino ba tatay niyan? <laughs> <laughs> ano, ano, ano moniker ng tatay? Robok. Oh, Robok ka po, oh, di ba? Hindi <laughs> matapang, matapang yung ano, matapang yung bata. And you know, hindi lang yun, pati si Susan yung oh, family niya matapang. Oh, actually, mas matapang pa yun. <laughs> eh. Um, and and I I I I really think uh, I I know you guys, you know, if you're going to win it, you, you'd like to win it as soon as possible, but I think the series has I mean, it's going to be long kasi yeah. match na match nga eh. It's yeah. hard to imagine na I, any team would win in less than six games. Yeah. Parang well, mahirap ma-imagine eh. Tama yun, pero sa amin, ano lang, kahit, kahit maikse, kahit tumaba, importante, manalo sana basta, kami. Basta, ano, basta, sana, basta oh, manalo. Sana Now, manalo. the other interesting aspect of the series, especially from, you know, like, a, like ako, from an observer's point of view, I also believe that these two teams, uh, yung samahan nitong dalawang teams na to, um, uh, probably two of the best na samahan mm-hmm. in the entire league. I'm mm-hmm. not saying na sa ibang team, eh, hindi yeah. sila nakakasundo. Uh-huh. Don't get me wrong. 
But it's just that when you look at, let's say, social media, yeah. and you look at these two teams, mm-hmm. itong dalawang team na to, parang barkada. Yes. Uh, di ba? Uh-oh. And this is parang from the, ano to, from, from coaches all the uh-huh. way to uh, the players, yes, di ba? Yes. So, kunyari, in the case of, uh, in the case of uh, San Miguel Coffee, mm-hmm. for instance, uh, you know, you, you have, ang dami yung character on the team. Ay, marami talaga. Oh, di ba? Oo. Oh. No? Grabe dyan. Well, of course, yung pagsinamo sa mahan na pinakamatagal na nagsama dyan is Mark, uh, James, uh, oh, Pingri, si James, si PJ, and Rafi. And Rafi. And Rafi. Oh. Yun, yung mga originals dyan. Yung mga original na ka- kape. <laughs> Hot dog na naging kape. Yan. So, yun. Talagang iba na talaga yung, yung sama nila. Um, tapos yun nga, maganda yung culture na dinala rin ni Coach Tim. Uh, dinevelop niya sa, sa team namin. So, kaya maganda yung ano, uh, nagiging resulta sa court. And Rain or Shine is a team that doesn't really change players. Yeah. Uh, gusto ni Coach Yang to develop players. Uh, at yun, magkakaroon ng kumpiyansa. And uh, yeah, maganda, maganda rin sa mga nila. Kasi ay, galing rin ako Rain or Shine. From the coaching staff at saka yung, even from the owners, they treat you as family. So, kaya naman, ano, na yung, yung hard work nila the past years, ito na, nagbubunga na. Actually, gumad, talaga lalo gumanda yung sumahan nung umalis ka daw eh. Oh, nga raw eh. <laughs> <laughs> sumaya daw eh. Para nawala yung BV. Para uh, nalungkot muna sila. Nalungkot muna sila bago sumaya. Uh, anyway, so in line with that, uh, we, eh, alam mo naman sa brosyo, gusto, uh, gusto, gusto natin mag-research dito. Oo oh, naman. Okay, so we scoured no, the Instagram to mm-hmm. show you anong kasing personality nitong mga team na ito. And we picked two particular players, no, okay. uh, from one from each team, mm-hmm. to show you na, you know, Parang these guys, they, parang they love what they're doing, yeah. enjoy sila sa ginagawa. It's, of course, it's hard work. Uh-huh. You know, being a PBA player is hard work. Oh yes, right? definitely. No? Uh, anyone who says otherwise, uh, wag nyo sila papahingan because oh. it's, just not, it's just not true. It's hard to be a PBA player. And, but yun nga, itong mga to, they enjoy it. And we picked Joe Devance for San Mico yeah. and uh, Raymond Almasan mm-hmm. for Rainer Shine. Mm-hmm. So I think we'll, let's start with, with Joe Devance. Okay. Uh, and, and, and Joe has been a friend of the bro show. Yes. Diba? No. Oh. And what we've learned about Joe is that uh, he can sing. He can sing. He can yeah, sing. Yeah, at least he tries. He tries really hard. <laughs> All out. Go hard. Oh, go, go hard when oh, he no sings. So we have proof. Okay? Alam mo, nung All-Star kasi, na bilib na bilib yung mga tao do sa NBA All-Star. Ang dami yeah. kumata doon. Si Farrell, oh. si ano, uh, ito, si Didi, yes. si Nelly, mm-hmm. si si Extra Rice Basta Rhymes, oh. ang daming kumanda, Earth, Wind, and Fire. Pero wala kang sinabi lahat yan kay JDV. Ay, wala. Walang sinabi. We have proof. <laughs> Sige, pakita okay, natin. Okay, let's show the first clip. The way you kiss me when we're playing the kissing game I like the way Tasking, ha? <laughs> Tingnan mo naman yan. Driving, singing, and dancing. Is, is, wala bang batas ang MMDA? <laughs> don't, don't sing and drive or don't sing and dance Ay, and drive? Ko, wala. Text lang raw ang bawal, eh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so, oh. Pwede, pwede yun, eh. Ay, tamo, talaga ang taas ng poses niya, no? Ang laki tao, yun, no? I like the way. Sa sayo ba, kumakanta rin siya, like during practice or... Does this only happen downtown? Not na? like that. <laughs> <laughs> hindi ganyan. Yan, no. Sa mga party. Yan, mga party. Ay, awan ko. Hindi ko pa nakasama sa party talaga si, si Joe. But, well, ginestrain natin siya sa radio. Sa, sa radio, oh. Ano yung kinanta niya doon? Yung... Uh, Roar. Roar. Yung oh. Katy Perry. Oh, kinanta niya. Oh, so, kinanta niya. he likes to sing. Yes. But, I know, you, I know you're a good singer. Uh, how would you rate Joe singing? Uh, because of my high standards. <laughs> high standards. Oh. <laughs> Pwede na mga... Because of... Uh, uh, showmanship. Showmanship. Yeah. showmanship yeah. Uh, eight. Eight. Oh, oh, sige. Uh, we have another clip of Joe. Okay. And think natin if he can improve yung eight. Yung, okay. yung eight score niya. Sige. Okay, uh, let's watch this. Hey. 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 Hey.
Ipo ay pikit pa. Chila. Hindi speed. Binago niya yung angle ng... Oo, doon ka na ano. Tsaka yung... Likes! Hindi na pipi... Likes! Grabe. At tsaka... Well, ako... Ngayon ko lang na nakita yan. Napapasayaw ako eh. Mapapasayaw ka talaga. May magkakaroon ka ng audience participation. Mga ganun eh. Habang nagdadrive. Paano? Paano? Para ka na MMD. Ano ba ginagawa mo, boss? Grabe. Yan, yan. Pwede na yan, mga nine. Nine. Oo, kasi may audience impact eh. Audience impact. Yan. Tsaka yung give extra bonus point for the picket mata. Yes. Kasi yung, yung alam mo yung pagkuha ka na kagat labi, picket uh, mata. Tsaka may yung, ano, yung high note na kuha niya. Oh, eh. she's high. Ah, <laughs> okay. Oh, by the way, so okay na ba si Joe? Because I know that he got injured during the semis, di ba? Yeah, oh, sa angle. Okay naman siya. Oh, oh. Sobra okay niya. Parang halos double-double siya <laughs> first two games. Eh. Oh, ano, so, ganun. Ayos siya. Okay. Yeah. On the rainer siya inside naman. Rock and roll! Ito naman, ito, napakmasayahin itong team oh, na ito. Ah. Karabi itong team na ito. Mm. Now, sa sobrang saya nila, naghanap sila ng mga laruan. Ito oh. yung mga tinatawag na laruan. Ah, talaga marami. Oh, yung yung mga, maghanap ka ng player, oh. kadalasan, it's a rookie. Yes. And then, ito naman, hindi naman yung binubully. Ah, kasi oh. iba rin yung bully. Eh. Oh, naman. It's more of, para bang brotherly love. Yeah, yeah. No. So, ang napili nila, uh, rookie Raymond Almasan. Oh, Talaga? Oh. Oh, rock and roll! <laughs> and then kay Raymond, meron silang pinapagawa. Actually, si Ryan Aranya yung may, may pakanaan nito. Oh, oh. And by the way, get well soon kay Ryan. Eh. Uh, anyway, get well soon kay Ryan because uh, na-spray niya yung shoulder niya. Not too soon. <laughs> right. Eh, baka game for yata, baka bumalik na. Okay. So, we have video of, uh, ito yung tinatawag ni Ryan Aranya na English time with Raymond <laughs> Almasa. So, let's See watch you. the first video. Hello. Hi, guys. Hello. I'm back. English time. Just finish practice. Damn! That's why it's so sad, man. So tired. See you on Friday! <laughs> Damn! I'm so exhausted. Ito naman si Almasa, no? Oo nga eh. Pero hindi ko naintindihan lahat eh. Yung... Si yun, Friday lang na... Ano, ano ba sabi niya? Can, can, we, can we play it again? Yeah, kasi hindi masyadong itinig. Kasi masyadong slang eh. Oo, hindi masyadong itinig ko siya. Let's watch it again. Guys, I'm back. First time. Just finish practice. Damn. That's why it's so sad, man. So tired. See you on Friday. Hey, tip na mo na. Sabi niya. I'm so exhausted. Oh, ano yun? Damn, I'm so exhausted. I'm tired. I'm tired. Diba? Hi. Oh, grabe, no? Grabe to si... Si Raymond. Actually, ang maganda dyan, I'm happy for Gabe Norwood. Why? May kausap na siya na slang ngayon. Kasi wala siyang kausap na slang dyan sa Rainer Shine. Oo, grabe. Kaya, I think that's why tinitrain nila si Almasan. Para maging best buds ni... Norwood. Uh, Para sila na ngayon yung mga, hey man! Ganyan, no? Kaya pala nagkiskisan sila ni Gako nung oh, last game. Ganun. Hey man! Gano'n gano muna niya tayong dalawa. Hey, I'm Jerwin. Oh, what? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, diba? Okay, so, we have another clip. Kasi, Meron ba? Meron! Aba! Kasi itong English style, kasi gusto talaga nilang pagalingin si Raymond sa pagiging slangers, eh. Oh, okay. Okay, okay, okay. so we have a second clip. Mm. English time with Rainer San rookie Raymond Almasan. Hi, English time. Hello. Hey, what's up? Uh, we're done in practice. See you in the game tomorrow. Hi. Hey, and roll. <laughs> Huh? Ano pala? Parang sinasab... nag-improve ah? Oh, nag-improve. Nag ang sinasabi pala niya at the start, Hey, English yeah. time! Yan, yeah, English time. Yun yung start lagi. Oo, oh, oh, oh. tapos oh. sasabihin niya, go! Kaya <laughs> si, si Ryan, si Ryan araan niya. Oh. At least game naman tong si... Uh... Oo, oh, hindi, hindi napipikon. Oo, oh, 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 diba? diba? At, uh, maganda, okay naman yung English niya. Tsaka importante yan dahil magkakaroon na sila ng import. Nandito na nga yung import nila eh. Oh, siya na ngayon ang magiging best friend ng import. Yes! Kasabihin so... niya sa import, Hey, hey English, English time! time. <laughs> Hindi nyo nun. Oo nga eh. Para kanina, ano ko lang sa practice namin eh, si nag-shower yung import namin eh. eh. Tapos tinanong ni Lester Alvarez, Hey, you eat Eastwood? Sabi niya import, what? You eat Eastwood? What? I'm going to eat Eastwood? <laughs> so, sorry. Ayaba mo. Huh? Baka nung naglalaro ka, ikaw ba kinakausap mo yung mga import? Of course. 
How do you talk to them? Hi, Joe. What's up? Hey, Joe. What's up? Lahat na lang Joe. Eh. What's up? Oh, uh-huh. Tapos pagka dumaan ulit, Hey, Joe. What's up again? <laughs> <laughs> tapos pag hindi maganda, laro. Kung kulay lahat, bye, Joe. Bye. <laughs> bye, <laughs> safe <laughs> flight. <laughs> Have a safe uh, Happy trip. Uh, flight. So, ayan. So, you know, that's just proof. Actually, ang alam ko, ang original na gagawin sa nila English time, si Jerry Teng. Oh. Eh, nung una nilang ginawa, tinapo ni Alvin Ting yung belpo. Ang ginagawa, saan ako? Agad <laughs> nagalit. So, tinigil nila lang. Ah, okay, so, okay. Nag-almasa na lang sila. Okay, so, good luck to uh, San Mi Coffee and uh, Rainer. Good luck sa inyo, bro. Yes, thank you very uh, much. I, I so, think it's going to be a long, tough series. Oo nga eh. You'll need all the luck in the world. Oh, yes, of course. Mas lalo na. Uh, uh, Siyempre, galit na si Kocheng. <laughs> galit na si Kocheng. You think makakita tayo ng one-time na uh, Yeng Salute? Uh, well, uh... I'm hoping. <laughs> Para mas spin. <laughs> <laughs> oh, ano man. So, diba, you're asking me, I'm hoping. <laughs> okay, what's this? Do we have a promo? What is, am I supposed to read this? Oh, okay. Hey, wow. oh, okay, listen carefully, mga bro. You can now get the iPad mini, or, uh, iPad mini with retina display and iPad Air on installment basis. Wow. Just check out Beyond the Box on Twitter. That's at Beyond the Box, PH, one word, at Beyond the Box. Again, huh? iPad mini, iPad mini with retina display, yeah. and iPad Air on installment basis. Just check out Beyond the Box on Twitter. Wow. Okay. Yeah. All right. Okay. And that's another uh, bro show oh, uh, yes. podcast oh, done. Oh, oh, oh. So yeah, marami tayong uh, kausap. Uh, marami tayong... May concert pa. Oh. Uh, may concert pa. So... One time nga say, One more time. Pa ba on? Uh, one for the road. Uh, Joe DeVance. One for the road. Uh, Playing the kissing game. I like the way you kiss again. She didn't want to live. Cause she likes me. She likes me. She's playing hard to get. Hey. Cause she likes me. Alam mo, yung maganda sa pangalap. Parang kinurot pa niya yung sige niya. She likes! <laughs> Nakakita mo naman yan. Partida pa. Umaga pa yata yan. Oo, oh, morning practice oh, pa yan. Oo, morning yan. Morning. Umbaga, oh. um, hindi pa talaga na-warm up yung boses no, niya. Oo, wala pang uh, warm up, warm up yan. Nakita mo naman, ha? <laughs> yung potential uh, maging Jackson 5 nitong si... <laughs> okay. So, thank you mga bro for joining us. Um, sa bro na this Jason, get well soon. Yes, yes. He should be back uh, next week. Uh, Saturday will be on 99.5 Play FM for the Bro Show on radio. And then if you're watching this uh, YouTube on, on iTunes, uh, keep on subscribing and downloading your episodes on iTunes. And on the New Media Factory website, thank you, thank you, mga bro. Thank you, bros. And uh, we'll see you next episode. Bye, bros. Bye. Thanks for watching the Bro Show, bro.